First elected in 2011, Hamza Yusuf was made a junior minister for culture, Europe and international development in 2012. In 2016, Nicola Sturgeon appointed him minister for transport and the islands. During his time as minister, the train drivers union called for him to be sacked following widespread disruption across the network. It followed growing dissatisfaction with ScotRail over delayed, cancelled and overcrowded trains. There was the exodus of rail passengers over overcrowding and train cancellations. And of course there was the ongoing ferry saga. December 2016, while Transport Minister, Yusuf was fined £300 and given six penalty points on his driving license after being caught by police for driving without insurance. In 2018 Nicola Sturgeon, proving she valued loyalty over ability, rewarded the hapless transport minister for his incompetence with a promotion to cabinet secretary for justice. In this capacity he spent most of his time desperately trying to pass the notorious hate crime and public order, Scotland, bill. The legislation aimed to introduce a new offence of stirring up hatred, and was described by SNP veteran Jim Sillers as, one of the most pernicious and dangerous pieces of legislation ever produced by any government in modern times in any part of the United Kingdom. It managed the dubious feat of alienating the Catholic Church, the National Secular Society, the BBC, the Scottish Police Federation and the Faculty of Advocates, and was only passed after successive amendments. After Yusuf complained about being filmed tripping up in Hollywood, a post in which he mocked Tory leader Douglas Ross for falling over at a football game resurfaced. In another social media gaffe, the hapless minister hastily deleted a tweet in which he mourned the death of a notorious Glaswegian gangster. In November 2021, Yusuf and his wife announced they were seeking £30,000 in damages from the Broughty Ferry Nursery they alleged discriminated against their daughter. The nursery accused the couple of launching a vendetta against them saying they couldn't apologize for something they hadn't done. The action against the nursery was quietly dropped by the couple in February 2023. A fresh controversy emerged after Yusuf announced his intention to run for the leadership of the SNP and become first minister. He denied claims he avoided the vote on same-sex marriage due to pressure from his mosque by arranging a diary clash. This account was rubbished by Alex Neal, the minister responsible for brining in the same-sex marriage bill, stating, the truth is he asked to be skipped because he was under pressure, and he then arranged a ministerial meeting, and that was his cover for not voting, and if he says anything different it's not true, 